But the guy is the most disliked elite grandmaster in the world by his peers because of a 15 year period of being a toxic individual. He touched the king. Touched the king. <gasps> Not only is he the most disliked grandmaster in the world at the top level, he's the most disliked by far. He is, he's also the most toxic online player that there's ever been at the top. In real life, forget about Twitch, Eric Hansen's like the nicest guy I ever met. Okay, maybe Amon's nicer, okay? And Hikaru's just super toxic, okay? That's the way Hikaru is, he's always been like that. If I just beat someone, I wouldn't like berate them for the way they played. That's kind of stupid. So, not a great personality trait. I mean, that's just the way Hikaru is. So, Deary takes some action and oh. look at this from Nakamura, a massive blunder. He's walked into a night fork, a basic night fork. The Black King attacked, the Black Rook attacked, and Nakamura is about to resign. He's losing a Rook, and Giri celebrates. Look at that, Giri lifting his arms up. He takes the win. Nakamura, he does, whoa, he goes for Oh, okay, is it a blunder? A huge blunder, and you see it on his face immediately. <laughs> Magnus Carlsen, he bluffed, he tricked Nakamura, he saw it immediately. Nakamura's just lost a Rook. But he needs to be accurate now, because his, his advantage is no longer long-term. There's a piece that's dropped off the Whoa. board. Uh -oh. Okay, I didn't even spot that. Nakamura just left his bishop hanging. Oh, wow. He lost a bishop for free. He forgot to defend it. It's a blunder. It's a blunder. car he's not even looking at the board and this is one of those i'm thinking about the position let me stare yep. at the ceiling this is just you know heartbreak for him you know i can actually go back to uh go back to something that's that's more fun than this um i mean obviously i'm not happy after today but i'll stream tomorrow and yeah i'll, I'll play chess again sometime but it won't be anytime soon that's for sure I was gonna play another move in the puzzle. Oh, darn, I should've gotten 54. Okay, but that was well, your... 53 was pretty good though. That's 53 was good. Yeah, that was pretty good. I should've gotten 54 if I played Rook H1 quicker, but. It was pretty awesome. This was an awesome little streamer tutorial here for mm -hmm. any streamers looking to improve their setup. Exactly, yeah. Welcome to Hikaru's world. Yeah, the fossil into double fossil into triple archeologist <laughs> museum. <laughs> oh my God. Oh. Were there times you were an asshole to someone and you regret it at, at the chessboard or beyond? <laughs> I feel like having that me against the world attitude though, it really fueled me when I was younger, feeling like it was me against the world, yeah. everyone hating me or me hating the world. That was very important. I was able to channel that anger in a way that really helped me improve. So like, do I regret it? On the one hand, yes, of course you don't. I, I, think, it, I think you don't want to be like that. On the other hand, what I've gotten as good as I am, if it was different, I'm not so sure. B4, H5, A4, G4, B5 takes, A5, there are B6, F4, B7, F3, B8, F2, Queen, B1. Okay, so I win that one. So takes, 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 G5, King, 6, takes, takes, G6, C6, H5, takes, takes. It goes this way, but this definitely doesn't work. Let's go here. So queen b1, king e2, queen c2, king f3, bishop c6, king g3, bishop f4 takes, queen g2, rook d8, king g7, because queen f3 is me. And if e6, you can go king h6, and if rook c8, queen f3, and king e5, and queen e4 is made at g5, you go queen g5, that's mate. He, he saw that in he saw that. A, a millisecond. He literally saw that in a millisecond. The car is an hour ahead on the clock. One hour. He's got over an hour 30. He's got more time than he started with. There's one person who I think you you don't want to be in time pressure with even. You would prefer to be in time pressure against Magnus over this guy. And that person's name is Hikaru Nakamura. Comes here it is, Rook H5 on the board. Hikaru Nakamura wins the Fisher Random World Championship. What a performance from him. He lost game three in the match. Game four was a draw offer agreed to. And Yana Pamshi gave all he could handle, but when all is said and done, Hikaru Nakamura stands the top of the world in Fisher Random. Is it fair to say Messi-Ronaldo comparison with you and Hikaru?
That guy is a full-time streamer. It's like when we play in chess tournaments and I'm a professional chess player and he's a professional streamer. Like, that's not fair. How did you learn within the years not to care? I mean, which, which answer do you want? I mean, uh, fine, Squirrel, I'll just give the honest answer. Greedy and Queen! No, he doesn't have enough oh, time! He's he's it's over! It's over! No, he's that's it! It's time. over! You see, Hikaru recognize it. He wins the speech chess championship. Magnus gives a little bit of a clap for Hikaru Nakamura. But what a performance from the American superstar. He has won the Fisher Random World Championship this year. He's winning Title Tuesday pretty much twice every single Tuesday. And now he has taken the Speed Chess Championship. That is your streamer. That is your SCC winner of 2022. Fans aren't happy when Hikaru bleeds out the clock, when he waits a minute to resign. Guess what? Every second that he bled out, this is the three second difference right here and right now. Hikaru Nakamura, how did he do that? He was losing for like 40 moves and he somehow built up enough time to bleed it out. He has won the match. Unbelievable. Your, your loss and Hikaru knows it. Queen takes G3. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. There's a queen sack no, on G3 and that, after that, leads that to main and he's done oh. it. Oh. oh my goodness, oh, that Hikaru. is beautiful. The word sexy, no, we have to use it again, you Daniel. Didn't girl. Oh. 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 Ooh, stylish. Rook takes F6, giving up his queen for White's queen, and he wants Queen E4 check next. And the rook helps defend the king if anything would happen. I think Andre is about to resign, so we may just see the moment where Hikaru Nakamura he stamps his ticket to the Kansas Express. Ladies and gentlemen, it is over. It's over. We have a champion, and we have two more players added to the candidates tournament, which will happen in 2024 in Toronto, in Canada. The candidates tournament will crown who will be the next challenger to the World Chess Championship against Ding Liren. I think, um... Hikaru has never had a better chance to to become world champion than, than this. I would say that him and Fabiano are co-favorites. Hikaru has been quite consistent recently in, in classical chess. And I, I think he has an excellent chance, so I think he belongs in the first category. Wow, Magnus, uh, good predictions. I'm actually inclined to agree with all of them.